with Dr. Gretar brought to you by the Ashley Clinic in Chanute, Kansas. The chocolate chip cookie effect. Heard of that? Well, if you shut your eyes and take a bite of a chocolate chip cookie, you may get a chocolate chip or you may not. And if you don't get a chocolate chip, you're going to just think it's a regular cookie. Why is this important? Well, fentanyl test strips. Yes, the CDC tells us that the chocolate chip cookie effect can occur if you are testing for fentanyl in these spatial test strips. Now, I didn't even know they had test strips. They suggest you check with your health department to get the test strips if you want to. But this begs the point about fentanyl in general. What is fentanyl? Well, it's a synthetic opioid, and you can overdose in it real easily because it's 100 times, can be 100 times stronger than and morphine, which is something we use for pain. So what are the symptoms of overdose for fentanyl? Well, pinpoint pupils, choking and gurgling, cold and clammy skin, loss of consciousness, and slow to absent breathing. In other words, people die from this very easily. So who gets synthetic opioids? Well, we do have them with legal prescriptions for people who are in a lot of pain, but we also have people doing this illegally, and many of these people have addictions. The important thing to keep in mind is if you get drugs over the internet or just from a friend, and especially with the holidays, somebody may just hand you something, you need to be extra careful and ideally don't take it at all. Yes, again, that addiction deal we were talking about. But why is this chocolate chip cookie thing such a big deal? Well, get on the CDC line if you're even interested in thinking about it because the testing can give false negatives, which can then lead you to think everything's safe when it isn't. Don't deal with addiction on your own. Give that kid a hug. I'm Dr. Greta.